Hi guys, Ian and Blake from the Football Boots team and today we're very excited because Nike have dropped their World Cup Boots pack. We're going to tell you all about it in this video. Stay tuned, we want to hear which your favourite is. Blake, start us off. We'll kick things off with the Mercurial Superfly 360. Now the colourway is white, metallic, cool grey and total orange. Very classy design. First impressions, what do you think? I like them a lot. I mean, it's nice to see Nike come back with um, a white boot pack. Nike do white boot packs really well. We've seen, um, like, what was it, the the shine through? Shine through. Um, it reminds me of the Euros when we had the Clash, the Clash pack. Clash pack. And that was like a kind of hint of, well, white body and then a hint of another color. Looks yep. really nice. It looks great on his. I like the total orange. It's nice to see something different with the Superflies. The sole plate is very similar to the black um, Superflies and Vapors with yep. that orange. And it looks really nice with the white as well. Um, it's a really nice effect. I'm really excited to show you guys the rest of the boots in this video. Um, yeah, Blake, what do you think? I mean, the design feature of this entire pack is the sole plates. They've all got a very, very nice chrome finish this time on the Superfly. It's an orange design. And what do we see on the back of these boots here? Okay, this is where it starts to get a little bit interesting because you're gonna see a lot of different stuff for a lot of different players um, in this whole pack. And we'll get into the details of it a little bit more. First thing I'm gonna say is because of the World Cup, there's 32 lines on these standard release boots. And um, that is one for each country at the World Cup. Then you've got the Mercurial logo on the back of these and it's a little bit raised, so it's gonna be a nice feel. And it's interesting to see that Mercurial logo on the back here because there is a lot less branding on the sides. It's just the two very clean um, yep. swooshes on this boot and that's all you see. And we also have the Mercurial Vapor 360, pretty much exact same colorway, nothing different there. But the one thing I will say is that the Swoosh logo has returned to the side of the boot. Unlike what you saw on the launch Superfly, it was just on the medial side, so it's good to see that on the lateral side of the boot. Yeah, the materials look good with that, and obviously you've got that kind of um, metallic grey type thing which is outlined by the total orange. It's a very nice looking boot. This is the indoor version, so you can get indoor versions in this pack as well. Yep. They've used the blue to accent this, and we'll see the blue used on another boot in this pack a little bit later on. Um, it's quite a nice little graphic on the Nike Swoosh there, yeah. and I quite like um, these um, Mercurial um, Proximos. They're all right, they're all right. Um, on to the next picture. Now, what are we talking about here? What is all this? Okay, so it's all about um, personal customization. So if you're from Belgium and you want to wear the Mercurials, you can get the, the, the Belgian flag on the back of the boot. Um, Hypervenoms, you can get the flag on the back of it as well. And we'll show you the rest of the boots in the pack. So like I could get an England one for the Magistas. Um, and the other thing to look out here is you can just see that it's Nike football and all this um, different branding on the back, it's like Nike football, Nike soccer, and then, or Nike football, um, German, Dutch, Korean, mm -hmm. any language in the world, it's mentioned on the back. And it's also the same on the boxes for these boots. So these are unique boxes for the boots in this pack, um, and you can get a special one. So it's very nice, and I love the combination. You'll get player personalization alongside of those flags as well, and it's gonna look so cool on pitch. I mean, these players. I definitely love the fact that we've got flags on the back of the boots. The pro players at the World Cup will be wearing the flags of their country. It'd be nice to see if we could actually add our own flags to if you want to get the boot yourself, adding it to sort of a Nike ID feature. I mean, in theory, they probably would just provide you with a sticker. If, like, you know, you might even get a whole sheet and that might be quite nice. Yeah, you can just peel cool. off which one you want. So now onto the players that will headline the Superfly 360 at the World Cup. Obviously, Cristiano Ronaldo for Portugal will headline the design. It's very, very nice there. Yeah, he's going to have his Portuguese flag on the back. As well as that, we've got Kylian Mbappe and Kyle Walker for the Superfly and a lot of vapor wearers, including Neymar. We've also got the likes of Eden Hazard, Coutinho, Modric, Leroy Sane, Isco Dembele and Dries Mertens. So now onto the next solo. What do we have? So we've got the Hypervenoms. These are gonna be headlined by Lewandowski. We'll get on to showing a little bit more about him in a minute, but the colors on these is the Vault. Um, and it's the sole plate has kind of got a mix of colors. It's iridescent and it goes almost kind of a green to the yellow. Yep. Um, and also the, the, the Vault that they've used isn't perhaps as quite a standard Nike Vault that you'd see all the time. It no. does have a bit of a green tinge to it, but yeah. it looks really nice on the upper and it's teamed in again. It's just the outline. Clean white boots. What do you think of them? I, I mean, I love them. It's probably not my favorite in the pack. Again, it's got that metallic cool gray swoosh logo with the vault borders and a bit of vault on that flyway there. Overall, pretty nice design. And one thing, this is, this is the same on the game of gold hybridums, is that the upper has that sort of crisscross texture on the upper, much different to the original hybridums we saw in the Phantom 3. So guys, make sure you let us know in the comments below which ones are your favorites in this video. We're keen to know. We've got another couple of boots to show you before we get there though. Now we're looking at the low version. You're gonna see Harry Kane wearing these for England. Obviously English fans looking for him to bang a few goals in at the World Cup. 
Yeah, as well as that, we've also got Marcus Rashford and Gonzalo Higuain. Obviously, Lewandowski is the headline player. Poland wear Nike, and it just makes sense. White boots, white socks. It's going to work really well. Absolutely for clean on pitch for those, isn't it? It's beautiful. Now on to the Magista Obra. What do you think of these? Very nice. I like to see that little bit of crimson on there. I think it's very sharp. I think a plain white boot with that red detailing is really sharp. Obviously, red and black looks good. It's that metallic um, grey with the red around it on the swoosh border. Very nice. The sole plate, again, it's interesting to see how these react under the lights. We will have a massive unboxing of these on the channel, guys, so make sure you subscribe for that. That will be coming very soon to the channel. Uh, Blake, what do you think of them? I mean, I think they're pretty nice. White and red, it always works with the metallic or grey swoosh logos. Like, obviously, Kevin De Bruyne. Fernandinho will be the headline wearers at the World Cup. Could this be the last pair of Magistas we're going to see? It's highly likely it could be. Goodbye Magistas maybe, so World Cup sayonara. And obviously this is the Magista Obra 2 Low, now that's what they call it. Obviously Andres Iniesta will headline this design, as well as Christian Eriksen and Casemiro of Brazil. What do you think of these ones? Very nice, I mean they're very clean boots, absolutely. Yep. You can't really say can't much more about off. this whole pack, really. I mean, like, it just almost depends on what your boot preference is, because they're all they're all very similar. Yeah. So one thing you probably can't see on the pictures is that the uppers actually have a sort of pearlescent sort of finish to it. We've seen it a lot on Vittoria. We saw it on the Vittorias Superfly Five, but it has an iridescent sort of pearlescent feel to the upper. Again, just another nice touch. For they're going to look so sharp under the lights at the World Cup. Like that's the idea of this pack is for them to shine out on pitch under the lights in these big games. You've got um, De Bruyne who is the headline wearer for the Magista line um, and it looks not nice there. He's got his um, pretend Belgium kit on. Obviously yeah, pretend it's a Belgium kit. Nike, huh. Nike red training kit. Yeah. But um, yeah, so then you just gave us a little tease. Let's move on to the tempos. Obviously the last boot in this pack is the Tempo Legend 7. This is white and blue. Again, you can't really go wrong with this, this design. It's really nice. What do you think? Guys, make sure you vote in the poll card. It's available now. And tell us which one your favorite is in this whole pack. I think that these are very nice, actually. I think when you're going to have leather boots, black or white for me, yeah. I, maybe I'll get a, a little a vault, okay? But these just are classy. And that's what you want from leather boots. They're really nice. Again, the sole plate there, and again, it's not just straight up blue. It's almost got a sort of iridescent touch to yeah, it. Yeah, you can see in the video, like the way that the colors move around in there, it just looks beautiful. And a lot of defenders will be headlining this at the World Cup. Obviously, we've got Sergio Ramos in his sort of fake Nike kit there. We've also got PK, Boateng, um, we've also got Varane, Thiago Silva, and Antonio Rudiger. So lots of defenders headline this tempo at the World Cup. So yeah, that's pretty much us. That is about us. If you guys want to know more about these, then make sure you head over to the website. We've got a page that tells you all about these, footballboots.co.uk. You can find out everything you want. If you want to get your hands on these, then shipping worldwide will come from there. Um, very easy to get hold of them. The question is, one, two, three, or four, which is your favorite, Blake? I'm actually not going to go for any of these. I'm actually what? going to go for the Vapor. So I'm going to have to go for one. You made this and you haven't put on the one you want to choose. What? I'd go for the Vapor. Have a word in the comments, guys. You're going for the Vapor. Yeah. All right. Uh, ooh, you've put me on the spot here. Let me say... That one? No. I think I might go for the Vapor too. Yeah, Vapors. I think a lot of people would go for the Vapor. It's a great pack, so guys, let us know in the comments below which your favourite are. Let us know any questions you have about this pack, and make sure you voted in the poll card. And as always, go enjoy your football.